Hey everybody, it's BC here, and welcome to another episode of Planet Nomads. Just taking the, the new rover out for a little bit of a spin. I uh, lowered it down a little bit and was having issues with, oh, jeez, with uh, one of the back suspensions. For some reason it was, wasn't dropping down and whatnot. But uh, it might be a little bit smaller. It won't seem as high, but we are definitely much better. I don't know what happened with it clipping through the foundation like that, but uh, yeah, we'll just forget about it for now. I want also might wait until uh, next week or about a week away for the big wipe here, and I want to do some testing for like possible highways. Like you can feel the bumps in this thing. I want to try the ceiling tiles one day. Maybe we'll do it before. Maybe we'll do it after. I don't know. And then same with the armored blocks. But let me show you what I did up here. I actually cleared up the top there. I got rid of the stairs and I put another floor in and I'm not going to make it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. That was close. So now I know I got my jetpack will take me up five stories. I actually made it up here before. I just never had trouble last time. But yeah. So now it's actually a roof. And coming down is nice and easy. All right. Yeah, we'll definitely have to get some power in here. I'll put some lights in later. But I want to go ahead and... I've been thinking about another building I want to do because we're going to be driving through this. I haven't decided how big it, I want it. Maybe it's maybe a little bit smaller than this, but I want two sections. So I'll have a tower here. Well, actually here and here. But two towers about the same height with a floor connecting them and see how that goes. Okay. Oh, and all my rover stuff is still on there. So... Um, I'm also uh, sort of wor working with the developers. They're uh, looking at the save file right now, trying to figure out what I did wrong and how I created so much lag in this world. Uh, I to told them basically the numbers I figure of conveyor sections, and they said in that area that that's got to be the limit. So leave it to me to push it, right? Uh, what else do we need in here? Uh, oh yeah, we need ceiling panels, which are already there, and we need stairs. Where are they? There they are. Be nice if they had other stairs. I was checking out the fences and the inner walls and stuff like that. Yeah, they're okay. You know, this isn't too bad, but it's got this, as you'll see it here, it's got that lip, and I thought about possibly using the floor section. Something like that. Like that, and then go ahead and put another one of those Oh yeah, I won't go there because I uh, put it on the wrong side. Oh yeah, that wouldn't even work anyways. Actually it would. Seeing something like that and then using number zero there. These tiny little skinny ones which might be interesting to build with. And maybe possibly having square houses, square buildings, but eh, I like this better. Don't really care for the, the bulgy too much, but eh, it's okay. Anyways. Let's get all this out of the way here, and I'm going to go ahead and start a foundation. I apologize for being a little behind on the episodes. Uh, this is something I have wanted to do, but I've been I've been lost in the shattered world, world of Hellion, and uh, that game is addicting. And it's basically uh, surviving in space. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and line this up. It's going to be... A little tricky. It'd be nice if they could add like a grid overlay. I think that's the right spot. Not even close. But I will fix it. Anyways, I'll bring you back when I got something. And there we have it. As you can see, it is a little dark in here. Uh, I don't think I actually got the parts on me. I should check that. And no, I don't. So we got to go get the stuff for the reactors because we're definitely going to have to light this place up. But let me show you what we got. Sneak. It's not too bad. I was thinking about putting an extra floor on top, but eh, whatever. Something we can look at for the, the next the next build, right? The next uh our next world. A whole new world. Anyway. Yeah, I apologize for that. <laughs> oh yeah, let's get in the reactor stuff. What did I need for this thing? I needed I need to get it on my hot bar for one. Uh, probably going to have to head back to Lag Central. I actually forgot to see what I needed for that. I'm going to go back to Lag Central because we're going to have to get uranium. So, okay. Alright, I know what I need. 
I don't think I have any uranium on me at all. Well, I got some in there, but I don't know how much I got. Yeah, I got nothing on me and nothing in here. All right, so reinforced frames, level two circuits, Mark II plating. I have mechanical parts, and I have. Uh, I got enough composites. Let's see how much fuel I brought up here. 106 hours. I think I got enough. <laughs> So I'm going to take half of that, put that in there, and let us get some lights in here. Oh, wait, uh, what do I need for lights? Two level ones, wow. All right, do that, and I have some. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be sleeping in a minute. And I don't have, well, it should be okay. Let's do this building first. Go back onto this side. I'm hoping that if I have the reactor on the third floor here, it's going to reach the door. And we'll just take the elevator. As soon as the elevator lines up properly. Oh, there we go. I fell down once with this one when I was building it. All right, let's go ahead and put a reactor here. Build that. And now for lights. The lights, I'm pretty sure, the lights will reach up to the top floor here. But then, I'm not really too sure about that. Alright, put a light there. And let's see if I can do this. Nope. And I hit V by mistake. Oh yeah. Uh, fumble fingers. Okay. I knew I should have put a railing on that thing. On those, uh, these floors here. I want to see if I can... No, I can't grab it from here. I can grab it from the stairs, though. Connect you there, and... Alright, well, it reaches up. See if it reaches the door. Oh, perfect. Sweet. All right, well, uh, I'm going to get this one up and fired up, and then I'll go deal with the other two, and I'll bring you back. Uh, I'll even make it nighttime, and we'll go through a little drive to the buildings, all right? Oh, okay. It is dark. It is all lit up. Let's go for a drive. See what kind of, see how it looks. Need a rear view mirror on this thing. Beep. Oh. Don't want to fall off this thing. Yeah. All right. Almost makes me want to try to build an entire city. Oh, let's see if we can back up a little bit. See that top floor. Perfect too. It's dark. It's raining. Nice rainy night. Doors are all working. Lights are all working. I was able to power this building up just with one reactor. I have it getting all squirrely here. If only you could adjust the steering, like the sensitivity. Let's get out. Yeah, I got the reactor right up there, up, right up there above the light, and that actually reaches all the way to the front doors on both sides. So that is pretty good. Go in for a quick stroll here. I don't know why this guy runs so slow. Mind you, he's probably wearing a hundred pound suit, so that probably doesn't help much. I was a little off on the lights. I was trying to get this done. Uh, yeah, that's all we got. We go all the way up to the top. And I really don't like how you clip into these parts on the walls here. There's a reactor, but yeah, nice big area. And I do believe, yeah, you can see the base from here. The window would get out of the way. There it is. Anyways, I think I'm going to call the episode here. i got to go meet up with my friend. We've got some few things we got to take care of. Ow. Uh, but, yeah, I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did... Oh. Oh, there it is. <laughs> all right, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave me a like, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.